Welcome to Good Mythical More. We're on a quest to find the most satisfying pop. But first, we're gonna take a new selfie face. New selfie? Okay. And this new selfie is hello from Disney Jail. So we've been told there's a Disney jail. When you do things at Disneyland or Disney World, you get put into a special Disney jail, which can't be that bad. If you're the greatest place on earth, you gotta uh, be the greatest jail. I on think earth. it's operated independently. Well, so, so what I'm do, still what excited we... because we might go back out and get a corn dog. Yeah, I definitely think this is just another ride. Maybe. All right, we got some stuff to pop here. Um, and we're gonna find what is the most satisfying thing to pop of all the satisfying things to pop. We've got uh, this green thingy. We've got the Jack in the Box. We've got some snack chips. Um, we got some champagne. We've got a magical color changing mythical cup. Let's see if we can pop that in half. Mythical.com, you get you get a variety pack of four of these, four different colors at once. So much fun. Unbreakable. Um also that that t-shirt. Unbreakable. Mythical.com. I tried to break it this morning. GMM Sunrise. It just kept folding. <laughs> t-shirt. Try to break a t-shirt by folding it. Do you know yeah. if you fold a t-shirt 17 times, it will reach to the moon? <laughs> what is it? Is it there's, there's like, there's That's something it. like that. There it's is definitely. there is a fact like that. <clears throat> so is bazooka gum the one that is easy to pop? Or does that? You're creating a placemat? I wanted to kind of get this out of the way because this is the thing that I feel like everybody pops. It's, well, it's sort of a standard of popping. I, I wanted to work on some gum and pop it later, but it's gonna take a little while because okay. bazooka is, it starts kind of, Rigid. Okay. I'll oh, let you man. do that. I'm not a good bubble blower. Bazooka is so hard. If oh, you're not? I mean, well, I then I definitely want you to try. Here. I'll get it to it. Why is bazooka gum taste as hard as a brick? I mean, I, it's hard I, as a freaking I like brick. bubble wrap. Remember many years ago, we made a video where we wrapped our entire a room in our old studio in, um, in bubble wrap, and we wrapped ourselves in bubble wrap. It's a comic. And then we proceeded to pop it all, but then it turns out that, that the was, sound that it captured, it was for that free free, free credit report. And, that wasn't uh, on our YouTube channel. No, but it, you know, old time folks might remember it, but what we learned is that we thought, oh, we're gonna wrap all this stuff in bubble wrap, and when we start popping, it's gonna make all this noise. It kinda just sounded like, people rubbing trash bags together, so we had to take popping noises and add them in post. Little secret. You just found out a secret, didn't you? Uh, Bazooka Joe comic, the fortune for me is, you may want to wash your old sneakers. When's the last time you washed your shoes? Like, I don't wash my shoes, man. I run them into the ground. This is tough to chew, it's then a set good them taste. On the curb. Free shoes! Now, the, do you do that? Curb shoes? Um, I mean, I, I take them to Goodwill. I, I, don't, I don't just put things on the curb. I do curb shoes. Now, you, you did the you did the twister, which I don't I don't resort to the twister until I'm really frustrated, because I like to savor each pop. Like, just just listen to this, and it feels good. Oh yeah, that feels good. Pesty. What's the first letter of the alphabet? You play Pesty. A. Right. And after, right. And what comes after that? B. All the rest of them. Man, they need, they need new writers at Bazooka Joe. Would you, you don't get any ideas, writers. Look at that. Now see, I'm starting to get, because you, you do want a few cracks, like, now that that is more satisfying. Once you get to that, well, this is how you have to do the the uh, the little ones. You know, have you noticed when they ship you something from the internet now? Okay. They're not always using bubble wrap. They're using like the pillow plastic. That's like the bubble is that big. Yeah. And like we go out in the front yard sometimes, and you pop it to kind of condense it down. That sounds like a firefight. 
in your front yard. Oh, we should have some of that. I was popping some of that stuff this morning. Well, I was actually, I just use a box cutter and go through yeah, it. Yeah, I cut it with a knife. It's re it was recycling day. I had to spend 30 freaking minutes to get everything in my recycle can this morning. Oh, that's your kid's job, man. I farmed that out to my kids a long time. I don't want to give my kids jobs. They might grow in character. My kids have so little to do at home, but one of the things is Locke's responsibility is to get, break down the recycling? Get the, bo the boxes and the recycling into the recycling bin. Is he good at it? Hmm, that's why he's practicing. See, that's why I'm doing it, because I want it done a certain way. I want it all to fit. All right, they're I'm, gonna grow up and they're not gonna do it, or they're gonna do it the wrong way, or they're not gonna do it at all. I'm gonna work up a bazooka right here. Work up a bazooka. I'm working on it. Oh, we're working up the bazooka. That was anticlimactic. Oh. That was also anticlimactic. It's facing the wrong way. You gotta go with your left hand. Up oh, and turn backwards. Up! Oh! Now I do know how to pop pop this type of gum. You gotta do it in your teeth. The, the, the reason this one's not fun it stops is it pops at the right place. Mm -hmm. It's not like the one in Elf. Yeah, I want to pee a little bit when it comes out. I want to surprise me. You can pee a little bit. You want to try? Um, that was not satisfying. Oh, s speaking of satisfying though, I discovered something in bed. Okay, all right. Um. And I look, I look forward to getting in bed every night now because of this satisfying thing that I discovered. Um, how did this start? I got in bed. I was Usually laying there. It starts. My lower back. With slow music. Uh, my lower low back lights. has been hurting like um, very white sometimes. From the when we were doing all the Zoom calls from home, and of course we still are doing that, but also doing the show from home. I got all this lower back pain because I was bending over. I was leaning over a lot more to like, I don't know, because of the lots zoom, of, lots zoom of framing. Lots, lots of leaning forward. So then I was in bed and I was like moving my hips and like, I, it's hurting right now. Like when I, when I do my hips like this, it hurts deep in my lower back. And so I was- Your hip flexors are tight. I was laying in bed trying to just see how bad it hurt. And then all of a sudden, I Shakira'd my hips and my back popped right there, like that low. Like not all the way at the bottom, but one vertebrae popped. And now, and well, and then the next night I was like, I remember last night I got in bed and I did this and I, I did it again and it popped again. And now every single night when I lay down and get in bed, right before I go to sleep, I just go and I pop. But my below her back. You know what would be more satisfying? And, the, and, the, and then it makes me go to sleep. Popping your back when you wake up. Oh look, we got some of that. What, pop your back in the in the first, listen, I got all kinds of back popping techniques, man. That's loud. You don't need to be in your bed popping your back before you go to sleep, that's not gonna help you any. Oh really? No, it loosens me up, so then I just You gotta to pop sleep. it in the morning. That's pretty exciting. Now, this one's got chips in it. That's. Not as satisfying, uh, but I, it should reset, and I should be able to do it in the morning too. Uh, yeah. L Lily has oh, started popping. Nice. Lily can pop all types of things. She'll be sitting there, we'll be watching television, and all of a sudden she'll go, and like jerk her head around, and it'll pop three times. She's got a freaking fused spine. Like the majority of her spine is fused because she had scoliosis and then they, they straightened it and they put two metal rods in. But up here and down at the very bottom, she can crack all of that and she cracks her hands and her wrist and her her toes. She's like obsessed with it and I'm like, that whoa. Can't, whoa, it can't be good. But she's like, no, it's good. It's fine. No, popping's good. It's relieving pressure. Um, I'm but telling she, you, you she can... like chiropracts herself. And then I, I told her the story that I just told you thinking she would be all, proud of me, she's like, how many pops do you get? And I'm like, one? She's yeah, like, listen, I'm telling and you. And then she's like I'm, te I'm telling you right now, if you, if that pop satisfies you. Go to the chiropractor? No, whoa, 
You're just experiencing just the beginning of it. You're sitting there doing the Shakira in bed. It's all wrong. You don't need to be. You need to be on a hard surface. You need to get on your back. You got to move. Your, I can get you popping. Whoa, that's good. Three, four, five vertebrae. So your vertebrae pop when you stretch every single morning. That's what I'm. That's what I'm going for, buddy. Dude, I gotta get over in time. On I've that. done it so much that uh, they pop less now. All right. So this right here, this so, may be the most satisfying pop. So far, the uh, little half ball is the most satisfying thing. And this is a close second. Okay. You gotta stretch your hip flexors. I saw a guy on TikTok who's like a doctor, Dr. TikTok. That's where I go for See, all my See, he can edit advice. Web, WebMD. And um, he's like, every morning you need to do this for two minutes on each leg, and he's got this hip flexor stretch. Uh-huh. And that, you, all this stuff's connected down here. You get your lower back uh, loosened up if you get your hip flexors. When you say hip flexor, you're talking about this right yeah, here? Yeah. Here's, a, here's, like a, here's, here's what he suggests to do. He says, every day for two minutes on each leg, get right here. Oh God. Put your... Yeah. Do that right there. And then, oh. Two minutes on each leg every single day. So I've got my foot up against the file cabinet and my knee on the ground. You got your heel in your butthole. Oh, baby. Woo. Two minutes on each leg. Every Two day. Minutes. Key to a good life. All right, so I'm not going to shake this up and do the NASCAR celebration because then you can't drink it. And that's dangerous. But I mean, still, if I just pop it. You can pop it and, and hold it. It'll still it'll still be satisfying. Oh, that's satisfying. All right. Or were you? Yeah. Up. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I peed myself a little bit. Um. Here, dab it with that. I'll lose something. Hip flexor. I might, a little I might bit. get my back to pop right now. Where's your wife do while you're doing this? Lays there. <laughs> she can't hear it. It's very deep. Rise and shine with the GMM Sunrise Tea. Available now at mythical.com.